Wayne Roberts. This is my 1972 LJ Tirana. Um, runs a 202 Holden 6 in it. Uh, Ford single rail gearbox with a high short and high lock stiff. Um, just done a PB this morning of 12.90 at 105 mile an hour. So, they're yeah, pretty good. So I've had the car now for probably about 15 years. Um, I think it's been in this current situation for about 10. So um, the car had done 12.95 passes before. So I just decided to freshen the engine and uh, come here today and see if we can beat it. So I've pretty wrapped it two passes and it's gone better than a 12.90. So why Delorto's versus Weber? Um, basically they were at a swap meet. Um, they were a matching set of triple carbs. So I basically snapped them up. They were cheap, bought a manifold, um, sort of threw it all together. This is a, a head that I've actually researched and developed myself um, with the help of a mate of mine, Mark. We ported it ourselves. We got come racing to flow it and put all the springs and all that sort of stuff together, but that was previous engine. Now it's still the same combination and, and um, it's all on top of a 202 before it was on a 186. So the engine itself is a 202 blue motor. It's got a blue motor crank, Starfire rods in it. It's got um, ACL drill light pistons in it. Um, it's generally pretty much everything that most people used to put in their Holden six cylinders. Um, it's got a Crow solid cam in it. Um, Roller Rockers, it runs a nine port head. That's um, a mate of mine and I did some research and development off a, a, another friend of ours that had a really good race car. Um, put a lot of time and effort into the head and come actually floated it, flowed very well. So this whole combination was put together and it's sort of been sort of strong and going ever since then. Um, I matched that with an ice ignition, which, is, which has been a great thing to, to own. Um, it runs a, a Yellow Terra light and flywheel. Um, a button clutch, a Ford single rail gearbox, um, which is probably what makes it quite violent on the start line, but you know, it's, it probably doesn't pull the mile an hour that a lot of V8s do. So it's made 230 rear wheel horsepower on the dyno um, before it was freshened. Um, I've never actually had it on an engine dyno, so engine dyno, I don't know full on horsepower for that. But yeah, it runs, it runs consistently and being a fully street registered car, it gets to see street duties all the time. So it's a pump unleaded runner. Um, today I race it on Avgas because it just gives me a better tuning window, but you know, I, can, I could go and do the same thing on, on pump unleaded. It's, it's awesome, it's great fun to drive.